this Shabbos and this Shavuos, when we are called up to the Torah, we will say, Baruch Atah Hashem, Melech and Melech Olam, Asher Bocha Bana Mikol Amim, Venasan Manu Es HaTorah. And many other places, we thank Hashem for the Torah. Why do we thank Hashem for the Torah? For giving us His most prized possession. Because without it, we would be nothing. Sure, the Torah gives us mitzvahs to do and mitzvahs not to do. But without them, we would be nothing. In fact, when we begin counting the Eimer, we're barley, the food of animals. But when we get to the 50th day of Shavuos, what did they bring to the base of Mikdash on Shavuos? Lechem, Shnei Lechem. We are bread, the food of people. Without the mitzvahs of the Torah, we'd be empty. Lately, we've been hearing a lot about the Internet. How the Internet is such a bad thing to bring into our houses and to bring into our work, and we should stay away from it. But the Internet is just a Nisayan. There are many Nisayans in our house every day, and when we step outside of the house, and what do we do? We overcome them. It makes us what we are. Without Nisayans would be nothing. So what do we do about the Internet? If we don't want to see it, we say, forget it. We don't go near it. And we pass the Nisayan. We cannot live without these scions. We would be nothing. It is what makes us good, Yidin. This is not a special Nisai on the internet. This is just another Nisai that we will fight. We cannot do away with it. We don't want to do away with it. It makes us what we are to stay away from it. A good Yontif.